Hello everyone, welcome to TechScale. So the phone is already rocking Android 12, but this build, the AEX build was not that stable. So today we are going to install a stable build of Android 12 in our phone. And the ROM that we're going to install is Project Elixir and the version is V1.0. And this is the official build and Android with that comes with Android 12. And we're going to install that and First of all, I'll uh, just tell you that the link is in the description of the video where you, from where you can download this and the rest of the procedure remains the same. What we have to do is we go to the TWRP section, press uh, by pressing the volume up and power button both at the same time. And before you do that, just let uh, just want to tell you that the phone will get formatted like completely. You have to wipe the phone. So keep one thing in mind. If you have important data in your phone, please keep that backed up somewhere. Right. And for installing that you must have dwrp installed in your phone so there are a lot of videos on the internet where you can find that so keep that thing in mind right so first of all just make sure there is nothing in the phone so i'll just go to wipe format data and since there is nothing in my phone so i'll just go and type yes just like that and after this the phone will get formatted i'll just show you and here, here it says the partition did, uh, something updating partition details and it's done right so i'll uh, click on here i'll click on install there is nothing here so uh, one thing we'll just reboot it and reboot back to recovery right so the room is already installed and i'll just quickly quickly i'll put the room file in the phone and i will meet you on the other end so here we are we are back again and here if you see i have the project elixir 1.0 beryllium and android 12 which is in my phone and i'll quickly just tap on this and swipe to confirm flash so this process you know might take around about five minutes to install so i'll just fast forward the video i'll just cut it down here and i'll meet you on the boot screen of the project elixir rom from the poco f1 so i'll also link the support uh, support groups link in the description so that you know if you have any queries about particularly about the room you can ask in that group or otherwise we do have a telegram channel as well where you can ask your suggestions and if you have any question you can directly ask me there so i'll link the link of the, the telegram channel in the description right here so i'll quickly meet you on the other end of this so here as you can see the process is successful i hope we are able to um, boot the room up in one go so i'll quickly just tap on reboot section and this will land up first to the poco logo and then we will hopefully see the project elixir logo and this process after that since this is a g apps build so this might take up some time to you know set the phone up like putting your google account and other stuff so that might take a little bit of time so i'll stay with you people for the time the elixir logo comes up so fortunately google is here and i i i don't know if, if we're going to see the project elixir logo or not so the room is very stockish so i think we are not going to see the pixel logo over here uh, the pro project elixir logo over here and we'll quickly just uh, reach on the setup screen so what i'll do is i'll quickly set the phone up set the wi-fi and set my google account in this phone so that you know i can test it better and i will meet you on the lock screen of the phone bye bye so here we are we uh, as you can see welcome to your pixel so I'll quickly just start going with this and I'll blur this up obviously since uh, this is showing my sim card data and other stuff. So here we are. We are going to so it's searching for the Wi-Fi networks and let me just quickly add the rate just like this and trust me the haptic response of this ROM is super super amazing and I'll just quickly set the phone up and I'll meet you on the other end. So here we, I am, I am in the middle of the process and I'll just quickly turn some toggles off and I'll just accept it. Let's see how the lock screen looks like. I don't want to do anything, just skip it and come on, come on, come on, just go ahead. I'll leave a reminder and getting your phone ready. This may take a few minutes and I hope this won't take any few minutes because the most of the process is already done. So I'll go with lights theme for a while yes i'll skip it for a while because i already know how to navigate so here we are it says welcome to your new pixel and first of all i will just change the wallpaper number one because this is a black background and i think i should i should change the wallpaper i change wallpaper 
and I'll quickly go on the something that is light, right? So that it is easy on you people's eyes. So on the lock screen as well as come on, man, I want to set it on the other end as well. So change wallpaper again and I'll tap on this. I'll tap on this again and home screen as well. Mm, both just like this. So here we are. We are rocking the new pixel project elixir this is version 1.1 and just let me do this come on just 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 have a look at this i mean this is just amazing let me see from where i can just okay this is looking very awesome as you can see that we have these big tiles over here and a lot of things are happening trust me this is the material you this this new ui is just awesome just just have a look this is super smooth super you know responsive and if i go to the settings okay something is wrong okay what is happening okay so something is crashing the settings i think i'll just restart it for a while and i hope it works okay for some strange reasons the settings are not working so i will just reboot the phone and i'll tell you again if this is working or not so after just you know doing a small restart the settings are not now working fine as you can see these are the settings and everything works fine I, I, what i could see and firstly i'll just go to the display settings and i'll turn the automatic brightness off because it's it's really irritating me i don't i want like more brightness and it's it's a little low so there is a dark theme toggle font size and other stuff colors booster everything is here and i think i'll just go with a little saturated this time so other than that all the usual options that we see in, in our all the custom rooms and specifically in the pixel so if if we see there are not a lot of apps installed in the phone as you can see this is very very clean and you know very basic apps that that we people require so let's go to the settings again and see what uh about the about phone section and let's go to the android 12 section and here as you can see this is the elixir version is 1.0 device very limb obviously and kudos to prab the device maintainer and here as you can see the 5th of october security patch although we are in november but you know this is android 12 and this is you know newly getting launched in the market so i think october 5 is is, is good although i'm expecting i'm expecting that we will see more android 12 rooms in in sometimes in future this month and to be honest i am waiting for the pixel experience android 12 version so let's see how it rocks for the time being i'll just test this room up and i'll you know do a, maybe a little benchmark and tell you people how this room looks like otherwise all of the things let, let's just you know do a simple call whether see if it works or not i, I think i don't have balance in the this particular sim okay so the calls are working so that's how it is right as you can see the smoothness is just fine this is totally resp okay no thanks this is responsive and all all the material you tiles and other stuff this is working fine and now we have these toggles over here whenever we are asked for the location we see the screen something over here and and let me show you one thing now we can directly turn off the mic access you can directly turn off the camera access now if i go to the camera i hope we have a camera app yes google cam is here so yeah hello this time and now you can see that we won't be able to turn on the camera because the camera access is blocked i'll just turn it on i'll turn the mic access on again and let's see if it works just like that it, it works perfectly fine as you can see this 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 is very really snappy and stuff so that's how that's how the room is like and we have night side and the other other usual pixel stuff right so that's how the room looks like and if you want to look, you know, want to install any Android 12 in your Poco F1, so do check this ROM out. The download links are in the description. I will keep coming up with uh, videos like these. A lot of Android 12 videos are coming up. Uh, I have like downloaded a lot of ROMs, so I'll be testing a lot of them. So do subscribe to the channel. And if you want to share, you can share it on Twitter or wherever you want to. I'll see you on the thread. Bye-bye.